crowd goes wild. Hey guys! Okay, so today is Monday and it is the first day of my last week of classes. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Here at Spelman. So, um, my day has been a little bit unorthodox, but I wanted to pick up the camera and make sure that I started vlogging. So it's about, what time is it? 2.13 and we are here now at Spelman. It's Jasmine and I. Are you still doing Yes, yeah, so anyway, basically, um, I have two classes today. One was at 11 and the other one is at 6. But my 11 o'clock one was like canceled basically because we have to, there's a bug. So have to work on like our final paper, which is supposed to be due tonight. But for some reason, mine is due on Wednesday just because of something that my professor decided to do. Like she switched everybody's due dates. So um, I didn't have to go to class this morning, but I did have to turn in a my last exam for this one class and it was a take-home exam which is so crazy like what y'all but senior year by major sorry the lighting so that is not as bad as um as these other semesters have been so me and Jackson were just working on that earlier today and I'm about to turn them in to my professor now and then I don't have class until six so we're about to go to IHOP and go to a little breakfast date because we're starving and we both don't cook and we both don't have no food at home so yes oh that's basically it so that's where my day can stuff right now I do have a presentation in my last classes at six so once I get back from IHOP, I'm gonna work on that. And then um, there's also a darty today. So I wanna stop by and go to that. But we'll see if I have time. Wait, wait we just sat down. Fucking $10 meal. Don't play with me. Don't push me off. Y'all got no customers in here. I'm hungry. I'm hangry. <laughs> Clearly. Clearly, she's very hangry. Y'all. <laughs> Why is Jasmine popping off when we just sat down? She's mad because when we sat down or whatever, the server was like, like, oh, is that my table? No. Because look at that old lady coming over here. That's what I'm doing. Well, if y'all didn't know, because I was um, in the food industry, working at Red Lobster for almost three years, I know like the ins and outs of different things. Hi, how are you? One second. Okay, we just ordered. So what I was saying was, you need to listen to this, okay? Certain servers, when you've been around for a long enough time, you realize people's ways. And a lot of people don't like to serve young black girls because if we get an attitude, like we're gonna pop off. Also, if it's just us two, right, we're out for lunch, we just sit here and talk forever and we'll take somebody's table up. And then they also don't like, I know there's nobody in here, I know, but I'm just saying, I'm just saying though. Like, let's say we were out for dinner and we, we wanted to sit down and chat and so we had lunch or dinner or whatever and we were just sitting down like we would be sitting there and talking for hours and it's like yo that's my table like they're taking up more money and then lastly when black girls get together like this they complain and they argue so they're gonna be like mm, my eggs are do you take your eggs taste right mm, mine don't taste right and so then you you're more likely to have more problems but like a group of guys together won't do that they're just like they all want to seem like they're so like chill and relaxed so people like tables of all guys they like tables of families because you're you're gonna tip of your family and they like what else do they like they like families they like men fun fact Probably why she's the one because she's like they're gonna be sitting down talking forever. Wasting my time. Look at y'all. Look at her, y'all. Yeah, I should have asked. So that you can have bad service all the time? Nothing. Is not. That's another reason why. This is why black girls this is why they don't want us at their section. Your service is not my issue. We need to put her into food service. That way we can see. I worked in food service, boo boo. Oh, boo boo. I was a really happy server. Lies, lies she tells. Can y'all imagine her as your server? I was a very patient server. If you have an issue or, or an attitude, my manager's around. Are you wanna talk to them? I don't know what to do with you. I don't know what to do with you at this moment. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. But my manager will know what to do, so I can just refer you to him. 
Would y'all want Jasmine to be your server? Comment down below. No, for real, comment. Because honestly, like, <laughs> that's who you really wanted to talk to. You're arguing with me so you can get the manager anyway. Yeah. So, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. But I can get the manager for you. Are you guys the kind of person where you always try and get free food at restaurants? Like, oh, it's wrong. <laughs> Manager, oh, it's wrong. Free food. Oh, you messed up. Free. It's like, you realize that that takes out of her check. I went to Mango's last night and literally, oh. yes, the food came in 2.5 seconds, y'all. We ain't even fin we ain't finished one conversation yet. Aren't you happy that you I'm got just it? I'm astounded. <laughs> <laughs> Back at the cribbo, gonna take me a quick little nap <laughs> before I get back up and finish this project. It's about like 3.30 now, so I'm gonna give myself 30 minutes, I'm gonna give myself 28 minutes to nap, and then I'm gonna wake back up, finish the project, get ready, and then go to school. I wanted to be able to go to that darty, but it's between 4 and 7, and unless I finish at 5, or really have to finish at four. Yeah, no, it's not happening. Can't go to the darty. Dang, I always miss stuff like that. I just don't have my stuff together though. I just, I didn't do work all this weekend just because I had a lot of things going on. I did my grad pictures this weekend and I also had to, um, like this mess Black Atlanta event. So I didn't really have time to sit down and do work. So, and I kind of like left it all like, oh, well I barely have class on Monday, but it's like, here I am with all this stuff to do, so. I guess my little outing event today was going to IHOP, so I had to choose that over. Okay, I gotta stop talking so I can take a nap. <laughs> Y'all, at this point, they just need to give me my degree, okay? So, I took my nap. Um, I ended up being waken up by maintenance, which pissed me off. But it was right on time, time for me to start doing my project. So I'm working on a presentation or whatever. Why did I not realize that we had a presentation and a paper due? by tonight so i'm freaking out freaking out freaking out <laughs> going down i hate when i can't remember what floor i'm on but yeah guys so i'm over here like oh shoot like <laughs> but i think that um i think that we're gonna get it done in time so sorry about the lighting, but I was just in traffic for five ever. I'm walking to class now. I'm like a couple minutes late and I was in traffic long enough to count how many L's I'm taking today, okay? Let me explain them to you guys. First of all, I don't know if you can hear that nice music in the background, but that's everybody parting it up at the dirty. And it's like, literally, why couldn't we had presentations last class and then today, I'm so sorry about this lighting y'all, and then today, class was canceled so I could have gone to the darty you know what I'm saying but now I can't go to the darty because I literally have class right when the darty is happening two my presentation is not finished so I hope that my um my partner finished the rest of it while I was driving because I had to leave like 30 minutes early because then it was going to be traffic here coming to school or whatever during rush hour and then lastly I was supposed to judge that pageant tonight I told you guys about that in my last vlog I think I said in the beginning of this vlog but then I just realized that the call time is 6 30 and my class starts at 6 so I can't even go to that so I have to literally text the um pageant director and then I didn't even remember because I told myself I was gonna do my makeup I wanted to film a video getting ready today and I need that by tomorrow it's just a lot and I wasn't able to do that either but I was just like oh it's not big of a deal or whatever as long as I get here for this presentation school is first so all that matters but <laughs> then I realized oh shoot <laughs> that means that even if I wanted to go to the pageant like after class I can't go because I have no makeup on and then I left my crown and sash at home so just L after L after L. I mean, really, like, how many L's can a girl take in one day? Please, somebody let me know. So, wish me luck. Hopefully, have you guys ever done a presentation and you've completely not prepared for it? And you're literally just sitting there, like, reading what's on the, on the board? I mean, yeah, you wrote it, but it's like, what exactly am I saying? That's what's about to happen right now. But it's okay, because it's one of my last presentations of my college academic career. Not the last, though. I got a couple... I think I have one next week too, but still, I'm almost done. 
I survived. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Y'all, I literally, I don't know how I just made that happen. I just got out of that class by the skin of my teeth. Like, okay, so we finished the paper right before we went in there. And my, par my partner printed it out right before we came. And then we were literally in class working on the presentation. We went last. We went. She was like, great job. You guys really touched on some important issues. And we're out of there. <laughs> how is this happening <laughs> like literally wow 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 i'm just so surprised that we actually like did that so yes i'm done now um like i told you guys i was supposed to be judging the pageant i feel so bad but i didn't even bring my cap and gown because my mind is just all over the place so i guess i'm about to go home now and luckily i only have one class tomorrow and she already told us that we're having a party we're having cupcakes and stuff and i love her she's so sweet so i'm just gonna um chill tonight maybe i can edit some videos watch some youtube relax as if, as if i haven't been relaxing already but like you know when you can relax because you know you got nothing to do i can finally do that for now let me make sure i ain't got nothing to do <laughs> Um, let's see today is what's today Tuesday it feels like it's about to be a Thursday it is Tuesday so I'm trying to get y'all here together on my dashboard there you go pulling up to campus now y'all I really tried to well I got all my stuff done for graduation I am officially like I've been registered for graduation but there's so much stuff that you have to do to graduate it's like why do you have to do all this stuff just to graduate so there was this like whole like loan module that I had to do and I've been splitting it up and it was high key due on Saturday and I just finished it today but they gave me an extension so it's fine I got that done so I did that this morning and I wanted to edit a video this morning but that took up my whole time and I wanted to prioritize and see stuff like that is why my videos be taking so long to come out because I always have to prioritize between why is the security officer <laughs> the security officer was just fighting a bee y'all I'm not trying to laugh at him in his face I'm not trying to laugh at him in his face but that was so funny but anyway stuff like that that is the reason why my videos come out so late because it's like okay I'll have a decision to make and it's either do this that's really really important or like edit a video so like today that was that but hopefully after I finish all my work this afternoon I can edit a video because I want one up for you guys tonight but y'all probably have already seen that video long and gone by the time you see this video because I'm just so freaking mind anyway pulling up to school now like I said today's Tuesday I'm really really hungry um I didn't get to eat breakfast before I came out here but um last class my professor said that we were gonna have cupcakes in class today because it's our last class so she better be you know living up to what she said and I think that's about it I just wanted to go ahead and uh say good morning even though it's not in the morning it's like one o'clock it's actually one o'clock on the dot so I'm officially late for class and yeah y'all let me share something with you real quick okay and if I'm out of breath y'all know I gotta walk all the way to the science center from the top floor of the Morehouse garage and I'm in these heels so I'll be a little bit out of breath but the most full circle moment just happened for me the first time I went on a college tour I visited University of Maryland obviously because y'all know I'm from Maryland and it's like a lot of college tours that they go on during like maybe middle school maybe middle school is my first time I think and when I went it was like the thank you I can't remember what day it was but it was like a lot of different people there and <laughs> If y'all know anything about University of Maryland, first of all, it's no HBCU, obviously. So a lot of people dress, like they walk around and they're dressed in normal like PWI attire, which is like shorts, t-shirts, anything just to go to class. And I mean, a lot of people do that here at Spelman too. But what's really funny was that when I first went on a tour, I remember seeing this girl and she was like in heels and I don't remember what she was wearing. I just remember that she was like dressed up and and I was telling my mom, like, oh, when I come to college, that's going to be me. Like, I'm going to be wearing heels. Because at the time, I don't even think I'd actually started wearing heels yet. 
it, but yeah, I was like, that's gonna be me. And my mom was like, girl, there's a reason why she's the only person dressed like that. Like when you're in college, you're gonna have all this other stuff to worry about and you're not gonna be able to be dressing like that every day. I bet you the person in the shorts and sweatpants or whatever is like really involved on campus and has a really good GPA. And I was just like, oh yeah, you're probably right, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, I'm walking to campus. Long story short, clearly I am that person though. Like, it's Tuesday, look at me. <laughs> Anyway, and um, I'm walking onto campus and there's a tour happening. And literally like five little girls come up to me and they're giving me hugs and stuff. And they're like, oh my gosh, you look so pretty. I like your outfit. I'm like, oh, thank you so much, you know. I'm like, thank you so much. And then I hear one of them go like to the, it, it may have been her mom or just like the teacher who was in charge of the tour and was like when I come to college I'm gonna dress like that and I was just like oh my gosh and I'm, I promise you guys I'm not making this up like I'm gonna ask my mom if she remembers this story next time I see her because I promise you it's true like I literally said the same thing and look at me now guys beauty and brain so it can happen hurry right, into my story time <laughs> Y'all think I'm ready. getting a second cupcake? All laptops down. Okay. I think we are ready. So are you feeling ready? Do you remember how we played this game I last time? No. Why are you going on my fave teacher like that? Stop calling her trifling. Because so, you know we over here stressing. She, she is trifling because... <laughs> <laughs> and I'm uh -oh. saying, I, I even went to her office and asked her. I was like, you know, I don't understand why I keep getting this wrong. And she's like, I don't either. It's just me. <laughs> Dang. She let me tell you, let me tell you what she did. Help, you have to ask her a specific question mm -hmm. that like she yeah. won't give you. You just can't be like, help. And she'll be like, oh. Help. <laughs> Here you go. Basically, you guys. So you she gave us like these quizzes okay, that we had to okay, do okay, okay. throughout the entire semester. And they're due on Thursday. And, um, you know, I'm Don't just starting the them today. That waited the whole semester to That's not the that. important part. The important part <laughs> is that out of the seven question exam, she won't let us see our answers once we've already submitted them. And there's like, okay, you can select more than one answers for each one. I selected all of them for each answer <laughs> and got a hundred. That's why I'm graduating spell in college because I know how to use my brain now, okay? That's no, what my degree know, told me. We know how to finesse. That's <laughs> That's what my degree gave me. Y'all see that? One attempt. Highest score. 100 out of 100. <laughs> so we took a little field trip back to Michael's. I literally have been here, I feel like, every day in this past two weeks. Um, because Toga is tomorrow. And I don't know if I want to go. Could y'all remember last Toga? Yeah, after last talk, I really don't want to go, but all of my sisters want me to go, and we may get a mahogany section and all this There's blah, blah, no blah. Huh? There's gonna be no sections. Oh, you know. I'll be in there clearing out all the tables for a second. Uh, so why are they asking us if we want a section? I literally just asked Morgan a day if they're gonna have sections. She just said no, they're taking all the tables out. So they can have more space at OPM. So did you go for Pretty Nasty? I didn't. They had tables and sections and stuff, and... So they're playing us. Y'all, let me tell you about how Jasmine's a fool <laughs> up in this store, okay? So, we go to Michael's. Really? This is going to be a lot more expensive by the yard. This is $34 a yard. Oh, oh okay. <laughs> this piece is $25 because the remnant. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Mm. But yeah, so we went to Michael's just to figure out that they didn't even have fabric there. So we're already in Buckhead, so we go to this other place. And she's, oh my god, it'd be so expensive, blah, 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 blah. Is that the white one right there? Look at this $25 a yard. That would've been cute. I'm good with the nine. But the thing is though, he that's a little bit over. You said that you wanna spend like 25. You could get 25. No. You hear me though? You could stay in your budget of 25 and get that. That other piece is 25, but that piece with the corners. Those, that piece, Th these are all thirty-four dollars. Oh, that piece, that's a yard and three quarters, is twenty-five. This is a remnant. Mm -hmm. Like someone cut it and they didn't want it. You know, oh, okay. This is the white one. Of the one you were looking at. Yeah, you said it's gonna be more expensive. It's that's gonna be remnant. thirty-four a yard. Yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. The other one is less because it's a remnant piece. Oh, okay, I see. Yeah. Okay. And this is thirty-five. I have, I have something I have on sale. Oh, okay. let's look at the okay. sale. What's the so yeah, I think I'm gonna do yeah, gold okay. because it's the closest thing to yellow. Um, 
So I'm thinking about this one or this one. So, this fabric is lit, y'all. But it's like, how do you sew it? I mean, what? What y'all think? I mean, it could be tight in the back, you know? Mm hmm. No, it's a lot more yellow. Yellow is not a So. Nice if you tie it on my side. I think that I can make it tight, but like worst case scenario, this doesn't look bad. Okay. Wait, can you tell me again how much my fabric costs for toga, please? Nineteen oh six. I'm so dead. Okay, you guys. I don't know if you can see this, but there are these like little you know those white things. They're not moving. Okay, look. You see these little white things? Yes, look like that. And sometimes they look like they're like a fur ball of dust or whatever. Aren't these bugs, you guys? Oh my gosh, it's like getting all over my fingers. Or is it dandelion, um, what's it called? Seeds. I feel like it's in my hair. Yeah, they're everywhere. I've never seen so many, like they're everywhere. It's, it's really hard to tell, I can't really show you guys on camera. They're like in our face. Look at that power. The damn dandelions over there. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna see if I can zoom. They're literally everywhere. I've never seen. I wish y'all could see them. They're in the sky. There must be it's a like patch. Snowing. It's it's either like a patch of dandelions over there. Uh uh. <laughs> it's either like a patch of dandelions somewhere, and they're all coming here. But like, look, guys. Do you see these? Let's see if I can zoom in. Maybe they are seeds. Because if they were not moving. I'm gonna say if they were bugs, they'd move. I swore somebody told me that those were bugs. Do you see them though, guys? You see all these little patches? I know y'all know what I'm talking about. The kind that are like, they look like dandelions. And they be, they come around at the weirdest time and just be like one at a time usually. I've never seen a big pile like that ever in my entire life. It's weird. Anyway, we got our fabric. Look at them, they playing over here. <laughs> <laughs> the bugs are playing. <laughs> Wait, what? So guys, we ended up stopping to get some food or whatever, and um, I don't know. Well, I'll tell you what happened. Jasmine was like, oh, you need to go somewhere that we don't have in the West End. Cause I was like, oh, we'll just go to Chick-fil-A. And whatever, so we ended up going to Shake Shack. So the Shake Shack here is literally at the Buckhead, um, Center. I don't know what it's called. Oh, the shop said bucket. So we're here, and I did not know, guys, that they have a NARS standalone store. So I'm like, oh my gosh, like I didn't know I had a NARS standalone store. So I like walk by or whatever just to see. And look at You know, some lip gloss take me up a couple of hours. I'm sick of her. But isn't this so cute, guys? I did not know they have a standalone store here. Next time I want to get a foundation, I'm going to come here instead of come to Sephora. But it's so cute. Y'all, we're so bougie today. Look at those beans. <laughs> Our $20 burger is right. Yo, why was my burger $15? I knew it was going to be expensive, I spent but like. $12. On a double cheeseburger. But do it look good? Oh my gosh. That's a really cute shirt, by the way, Jazz. Oh my gosh, Jasmine's about to have us kill, first of all. Second of all, y'all, what song is this? I spread my wings and I love how to fly. It was like a horse movie on um, da, 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 Disney da, da, Channel. Da, 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 just make a wish. Wait up, we're right here by Party City. Okay. I feel like you're going. Continue here. to follow the road for the three miles. Okay. Who sings that song? Yeah. Okay, then it wasn't Miley Cyrus. Miley Cyrus would never have Kelly Clarkson as her uh, soundtrack. Come on, let's, let's, let's listen to it. Let's Google it. You got it on your phone? You need it on mine. I spread my wings and I love how. Yeah, I'm about to get the.
Wednesdays and Fridays and Mondays or whatever, right? So technically, technically any day. She literally has classes only on Tuesdays and Thursdays, and so she technically just had. Ignore my hair, y'all. Y'all see me? I've been blowing in the wind. But she just had her last class ever. Y'all driving like so y'all driving Daisy out here. Anyway, and y'all saw we literally were playing Jeopardy and we had cupcakes. That could be. That literally is the best last day of class you could possibly ask for. What did you just do? <laughs> I got you on tape. <laughs> anyway, so I was asking her how does she feel about her last day of class. I'm gonna tell y'all how I feel tomorrow. But your last time taking classes from a college, how do you feel, Jazz? Liberated. I feel like NASA just let me off the hook. <laughs> Massa just let she said I feel like Massa just let me off the hook. Well on that Massa, note go ahead on sir. Here's your Freeman's note too. <laughs> wow. That's what I thought I'm getting. I'm getting a piece of paper and that's saying that you don't need nothing else from us. Thank you for your payment. You're a free black man. Thank you for your payment of forty six thousand dollars a year. Here you go in exchange for it. Congrats. Because honestly, what, a, high, a high school degree barely done nothing now. What is a master's, what is a bachelor's degree doing? You need five years of experience still. I feel like master just let me out the, out the gates. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Say hey to the vlog. What's up? I'm really like not looking good right now, but we're somehow supposed to go to this award show. <laughs> Look at my You guys are looking at the next. Oh, don't even, don't even do me like <laughs> okay, okay, we'll just tell them. Um, Ooh, Ryan, you look cute. Thank you. I was nominated for the Essies for Best Freshman. Best Freshman! Yes! Wait, wait, I know I lost, but I'm like 30 minutes late. That's my let's sisters. Go. Okay, let's go. Yeah, so good. We can just write this song out. Okay, y'all, so I'm just getting home. Today felt like the longest day ever. I'm about to lay down for two seconds and then I gotta get up so I can roll my hair and then take a shower because I have to basically write a paper tonight it's not due until tomorrow night but tomorrow night is toga so I need to go ahead and get the paper finished now so that way when I turn it in I'm done okay and I have a, um, a meeting already with my professor um, tomorrow in the middle of the day so she can look over it so I'm, that paper should be in by max 2 p.m. tomorrow but I have class all the way until 5 30 so I'm probably not gonna do anything too crazy tomorrow as far as like my outfit or anything for toga goes I'm gonna try and maybe like wake up early and go to the dollar store so I can get some greenery for my toga and I'm just gonna get that from the dollar store up the street and then after that yeah because I'm probably just gonna do like a glittery eye nothing like too crazy like last year I went all out it's not that deep. I'm tired. So, yeah, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow.